What's up, Steve from Flight Brothers here, and today I'm taking a look at the Dollprop T5045 Bullnose and the Dollprop T5045 Props. And I'm going to see if there really is a difference in the amp draw and thrust between the two different props. So obviously the Bullnose Prop is a little bit wider, it has a, a wider end, whereas the, the racing prop that they call it, just the regular T5045, it's more of a blunt nose. It's not as wide. doesn't quite have enough material. Let's first check the weight on these. All right, first up on the scale, the bull nose, weighing in at 6 grams. And next up is the blunt nose racing prop. About 5 grams. So we do have 1 gram lighter on the racing prop. So here I have my homemade thrust stand all set up. I have a Black Edition ready-made RC 2204-2300KV motor on there. And right now I have the 5045 Bullnose Tri-Prop on ready to go on my Dahl RC 20 amp ESC. And we're going to go ahead and give that a shot. Alright, my battery's been charged up and I'm ready to go. Here we go with our first test on a 4-cell. All right, let's switch them up. So I've recharged the battery, and I now have one of the Dahl T5045 tri-props on. This is the blunt nose, what they call the racing prop. We're going to go see what kind of difference this makes, if it really draws less amperage and by how much. All right, and here we go. So, as you can see by the test between the bullnose and the racing edition props, between the two of them, the bullnose prop was drawing about three more amps than the racing edition. And what was interesting is that the thrust on both of them was about the same, both of them peaking around 680 grams of thrust. So, if you're looking for a prop that's just a little more efficient and has just as much thrust as the bullnose, the racing prop might be the prop for you. Check it out. Thanks for watching.